let p q r be a triangle with r is a vertex minus 1 comma 4 comma 2 and m is the midpoint of the line segment p q so we can consider m is the midpoint so 2 comma 1 comma 2 and the distance of centroid of triangle from the point of intersection of two lines so we know that centroid is the point of concurrence of the medians the line segment joining from vertex to the midpoint of its opposite side is called the median say rm is the median and the centroid centroid divides the median in the ratio 2 is to 1 from the vertex so we can say r is a point minus 1 comma 4 comma 2 and m is another point 2 comma 1 comma 2 and g is the centroid which is dividing 2 is to 1 from r so we can get the centroid by using the section formula as 2 times of x2 that is mx2 we have the formula mx2 plus nx1 upon m plus n similarly y coordinates so we can write 2 times of 2 plus 1 times of minus 1 divided by 1 plus 2 plus 1 comma and again 2 times of 1 plus 1 times of 4 divided by 2 plus 1 2 times of 2 plus 1 times of 2 divided by 2 plus 1 so we can get the centroid as 4 minus 1 3 upon 3, 2 plus 4, 6 upon 3, 4 plus 2, 6 upon 3, which is equal to g 1 comma 2 comma 2. So 1 comma 2 comma 2 is the centroid of the given triangle. Let's find the point of intersection of two lines. x minus 2 upon 0 is equal to y upon 2 is equal to z plus 3 upon minus 1 say is equal to lambda and x minus 1 upon 1 is equal to y plus 3 upon minus 3 is equal to z plus 1 upon 1 is equal to say mu so here we can write the x coordinate as 0 into lambda here we can x minus 2 upon 0 is equal to lambda we get we get x is equal to 0 into lambda plus 2 so 2 and y is equal to 2 lambda and z is equal to minus lambda from here minus lambda minus 3 and similarly from the other line we can write x is equal to mu plus 1 and y is equal to minus 3 mu minus 3 and z is equal to mu minus 1 so that For the point of intersection, x coordinates and y coordinates, z coordinates of both the lines must be same. So for point of intersection, so equating the coordinates respectively, so we get, so here 2 and mu plus 1. So mu plus 1 is equal to 2, which implies mu is equal to 1. And the next one, 2 lambda is equal to minus 3 mu minus 3. So when mu is equal to 1, we can substitute 2 lambda is equal to minus 3 into 1 minus 3, that is minus 6. So lambda is equal to minus 3. So we got the value mu is equal to 1 and lambda is equal to minus 3. Substituting any one of the value in any one of this line equation, we get the coordinates point of intersection. The point of intersection is x is equal to 2, y is equal to 2 into minus 3 and z coordinate is equal to minus of minus 3 minus 3. So that is x is equal to 2, y is equal to minus 6 and z is equal to 0. So the 2 comma minus 6 comma 0 is the point of intersection of the line. Let us consider to be say this is m and now we need to find the distance of the centroid to the point of intersection. So centroid is, we have the centroid is 1, 2, 2. 
and the distance between these two points say mg is equal to under root of x2 minus x1 whole square that is 2 minus 1 whole square plus minus 6 minus 2 whole square plus 0 minus 2 whole square which is equal to root of 2 minus 1 1 square is 1 minus 6 minus 2 minus 8 whole square is 64 and minus 2 whole square is 4 so which is equal to root of 69 so root 69 is the answer so we can go with an option d option 4